Yamaha introduces a new 2020 Grizzly XTR and Kodiak 450 with a front diff lock. Pro ATV Motocross National Wrap-Up from Ironman Raceway. New Sport Quad products from Texera Tech. Personal gear cases from Pelican. And a new Can-Am Renegade front bumper from HMF. Plus, ATV On Demand produces the number one test videos on YouTube for the exciting new 2020 Polaris Scrambler and Sportsman XP1000S. Hey guys, I'm Chad. This is ATV On Demand News for the month of September 2019. We're going to kick this show straight off with our first looks at this month's features. Earlier this month, Yamaha gave us our first look at the all-new XTR models for select proven off-road 2020 ATV and side-by-side -side vehicles. Said to offer superior capability, comfort, and confidence through a variety of terrain, the new XTR models come with upgraded tires, a worn winch, the all-new titanium bronze and tactical black color schemes, and more. Yamaha's 2020 XTR editions include the recreationally focused Wolverine X2 and X4, the Grizzly, and the Pure Sport YXZ 1000R Sport Shift. According to Steve Nessel, Yamaha Motorsports Marketing Manager, Yamaha is stepping up their proven off-road lineup this year, taking trail performance and showroom appeal to the next level. The Grizzly 700 has been a favorite big bore 4x4 ATV among our staff since its inception. Due to its good power, two and four wheel drive system with lockable front differential, good all around suspension, and relatively light and nimble handling. The 2020 Grizzly XTR claims to bring even more riding exhilaration thanks to its potent and proven 700 class engine. Superior E-coated chassis running Yamaha exclusive 27 inch Maxisilla tires, roomy ergonomics, advanced electronics, and stylish XTR edition painted bodywork. The 2020 Grizzly XTR includes a factory installed worn ProVantage 2500 pound winch and is pre-wired for the Yamaha Adventure Pro GPS, furthering one's off-road excursions on an ATV. It is also equipped with Yamaha standard real-world tech, including an Ultramatic automatic transmission, on-command two-wheel drive, four-wheel drive system, and EPS. The 2020 Grizzly XTR will be available at Yamaha dealers this fall in the all-new titanium bronze and tactical black color schemes. The MSRP will be $10,999. All of those XTR edition Yamahas look maximum cool. And new for 2020, Yamaha increased the capability of the Kodiak 450 SE by adding on-command four-wheel drive with locking front differential. According to Yamaha, the 2020 Kodiak 450 SE combines Yamaha's legendary durability and reliability with class-leading handling. Powered by a 450-class single-cylinder liquid-cooled engine with electronic fuel injection, it delivers work-ready performance with more than 1,300 pounds of towing capacity, while its compact and nimble chassis handles tight and technical trails. Delivering proven off-road capability, comfort, and confidence, the 2020 Kodiak 450 SE boasts Yamaha's standard real-world tech. Features include an Ultramatic automatic transmission, EPS, adjustable dual A-arm suspension, and for the first time ever on a Kodiak 450, the Tactical Green SE model features Yamaha's three-position on-command four-wheel drive, with two-wheel drive, four-wheel drive limited slip, and four-wheel drive with full locking differentials. This rugged new special edition Kodiak also includes a factory installed worn ProVantage 2500 pound winch, premium alloy wheels to complete an already well-equipped package. The 2020 Kodiak 450 SE with aluminum wheels is available in a matte silver at an MSRP of $7,599. The new tactical green SE with on-command four-wheel drive and a worn winch is an MSRP of $7,999. In racing news, the 2019 Pro ATV Motocross National Championship and AMA National Championship concluded Friday, August 23rd at Ironman Raceway. The season finale was held in conjunction with Lucas Oil Pro Motocross National Championship Series. The AMA Pro class would once again come down to the final round, with just single-digit points separating Wienan Motorsports, Maxxis, Yamahas, Chad Wienan, from Phoenix Racing, Honda, Maxxis, Elkas, Joel Hetrick. Hetrick landed the first blow by taking the whole shot and holding on for the win in Moto1. Wienan held on to second place, kicking the bar up a notch, as everything would now come down to the final moto for the overall 2019 National Championship. 
as the gate dropped for Moto2, Weenan didn't have a great start. However, he was able to pass enough riders to eventually take the lead and hold on for the win. Hetrick managed to hold on to third place, giving him enough points for the overall 2019 National Championship. Be sure to check out and support the ATV motocross races when they come to your area. It is the racers that push the aftermarket and performance products industry forward. Now it's time to take a look at this month's product features. Need some ideas for storing and hauling your valuable equipment on your next off-road adventure? Well, Pelican Cases has the answer. Pelican Products Inc. is known for their premium, high-performance cases, including the Pelican Air, the Classic Protector Case, and the Storm Case. Recently, Pelican introduced the brightly colored Marine Blue and Bright Green to the rock-solid and more affordable Vault by Pelican. Designed to offer class-leading durability and dependability protection for sensitive gear such as camera equipment, drones, and other fragile items you might want to protect on your next outing, the new Bright Green and Marine Blue equipment cases are available in the V100 and V200 sizes. The full line of Vault by Pelican cases range in price from $39.99 to $199.99 and are backed by a one-year guarantee. To learn more, go to pelican.com slash vault. Texeratech's Next Level Spindle and Hub Package for Sport ATVs is designed to improve steering precision and reduce bump feedback to handlebars by taking the LTR450's geometry to the next level. They're said to maximize kingpin inclination to reduce tire scrub while turning. They're also designed to provide more consistent tire camber while cornering. They feature billet aluminum construction with heat-treated chrome alloy spindle shafts, Timken tapered hub bearings, and are made in the USA. The next level spindle and hub package is designed to work with Honda ball joints and will narrow your ATV approximately a half inch per side. They may work with some aftermarket A-arms, but deliver the ultimate in handling and performance when paired with Texeratex next level A-arms. Texeratech's next level spindle and hub package starts at $1,349. For more information, visit texeratech.com. HMF just introduced the Can-Am Renegade Defender HD front bumper. HMF has an ever-expanding line of hard parts for popular 4x4 and sport ATVs. One of their latest additions is the feature packed Defender HD bumper. The HMF Defender HD front bumper fits up to a 3,500 pound winch and is said to be a durable, lightweight front bumper that's ideal for riders looking to add front end protection without a lot of weight. The HD front bumper works with ATV fair leads that have a 4 by 7 inch hole spacing, with room to install a 4 inch LED light in the center. Weighing around 19 pounds with great aesthetics and increased functionality, the Defender front bumper should make an incredible addition to the front of the Renegade. The Defender HD bumper is available in a variety of colors to match the looks of your Renegade. It fits 2012 and newer Renegade 570, 800, 850, and 1000 models. The MSRP is $269.95. For more information, visit HMFRacing.com. If your company has a product you'd like featured on our show, send us an email to info at ATVOnDemand.com. All right, guys, now it's time to take you inside ATV On Demand to let you know what's upcoming for the channel. But first, we want to take a minute to thank you for making ATV On Demand number one. If you're diehard ATV enthusiasts like us, then you're probably aware of Polaris's brand new 2020 Scrambler XP1000S Sport 4x4 and the Sportsman 1000S Sport Utility ATVs. Not just new machines, their 55 inch width and suspension travel rivals that of modern motocross dirt bikes, creating two new ATV segments. We're sure that their wide trail performance is sure to put a smile on the face of anyone who throws a leg over them. If you ride an ATV on trail shared with most side-by-sides, you should have plenty of room to get loose. We wanted to take a second to thank ATV On Demand subscribers for helping take our Scrambler S and Sportsman S test videos to number one on YouTube. At the time of this recording, the Scrambler video has passed 200,000 views. We truly appreciate all of your views and the kind comments. Here's some of my personal favorites. Why is your channel so underrated? I could listen to this guy review stuff all day. And even the ones who keep it simple. Love it. We even appreciate the not so nice ones. That thing has a face only a mother could love. Or junk and weighs a ton. Test filming has been completed for ATV On Demand's 1000cc 4x4 ATV shootout, and we're currently finishing up filming interviews, so that video will be coming along soon. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss it. 
All right, guys, at this point, the checkered flag is flying on our first installment of ATV On Demand News. Make sure to leave us a comment with your thoughts and suggestions. And again, we truly appreciate the support and interactions. We'll be back again in October, and we hope you join us then. Thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe to ATV On Demand for more great content.